our board chose Governance Evaluator because on our journey of governance, they've got to the stage where they are very strong in governance, but with the new standards coming on board, they realised that they had a gap in the clinical governance. And so they saw that the Governance Evaluator was age specific and was really the right organisation to lead us to the next level for our governance journey. Our experience in working with the Governance Evaluator was amazing. They were so professional in every aspect of taking us on the journey of looking at what we we're doing, even explaining their role and their whole business model, if you like. And so our board were totally engaged with them and it was easy to sign on. The results so far to date with the Governance Evaluator, we've completed the assessment tool and I have to say that has generated conversation at the board level, not only between the individual board members, but within the team itself, so that they're starting to see where their gaps are and they're actually really excited because they're realising the strength of their governance oversight for Lindock. Other boards who haven't undergone the governance process, I think, are really putting the organisation that you govern at risk. We need to be on the forefront for aged care in governance with the new standards coming on board. You need to understand where you are at and where you do have to go. And it is really about governance, both clinical and corporate, and you need to make sure that you are providing the oversight to provide safe quality care and service to the residents that you are managing overseeing.